Our next problem is that of a baseball bat, which has a velocity of positive v. It collides with a baseball that is coming towards the bat with a velocity of 2v, so negative 2v. The bat barely changes a velocity during the collision. How fast is the baseball going after it's hit? Well, let's review the information we're given. We have that the velocity of the baseball bat, v1, before it is positive v and after the collision is positive v. That of the baseball is negative 2v and we're trying to find the velocity of the baseball afterwards. That's v2 prime. So using our elastic collision equation v1 plus v1 prime equals v2 plus v2 prime we'll rearrange first as we've done before to get v2 prime by itself. We do that by subtracting v2 from both sides. If we then substitute what we know, we have that v2 prime is equal to v for the baseball bat before plus v for the baseball bat after minus the negative 2v of the baseball before it was hit. If we add all this up, we get that the baseball will be going four times the velocity of the bat um, after it's hit, or twice its original velocity, and obviously in the opposite direction, that of the bat.